Hello everyone and welcome to- uh, God, why do I keep having strokes in the beginning of my videos? It's like the third time in a row. Hello everyone and welcome to episode 14 of the Wizard 101 Let's Play series. Last episode, finished um, Mount Olympus. Um, also, I know my stitch is just getting worse. Like, it, j the longer I go, the worse it gets, but I can't do anything about it. Now, anyways, I said I was going to do Mushu last time, but I jabated you again. I, I've double jabated you now, and I've decided I'm doing um, Wisteria because I co totally forgot that that's a thing. So I'm going to go do Wisteria real quick. Um, you may notice I am level 32. Also, you may notice I, didn't, I don't actually have all the Zeus gear like I said I was going to farm for at the end of last episode. That is okay. Also, Jesus Christ. Okay, too many people. Oh, Pixie works. But, um, yeah, you may notice I don't have the Zeus gear like I said I was going to. And that's because, uh, there's no reroll chest, which is really annoying. So I did it, and, um, there, basically, uh, yeah, I, 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 um, I only got the boots. I got the boots twice, actually. And, uh, I was kind of annoyed, kind of exasperated. Um, I also I did get the senator's hat, which is pretty good. It uh, it's it's still obviously better than the previous Hujima. What's it? My, my previous hat. I actually want to um. Okay, yeah, I got two of them. So I got two hats and two boots, but no robe. And um, obviously that was annoying me. Um, so I, I went and did Kimbalung Village also because I wanted more XP. That got me up to level 32, almost level 33. And, um, you inspect the spiral cup, the greatest pride in all the I, spiral. It looks like it's been here. To be honest, I don't know how great of a prize it is, but whatever. <coughs> Jesus Christ. Well, well. <sighs> Is it a Ravenhood, huh? How crazy, okay? Fuck you. You know what? I actually want to use um, lightning bats. I want to see how much my... I want to see how much damage I have now. Like, how much my added damage boosts it. I think it's actually enough to kill, but I'm not sure. Oh my god. Okay. Um, so, yeah, as I was saying, I did Kimbalung Village, um, decided to do that off camera because I don't really care, um, honestly, I might do Barkingham Palace on camera, I, I didn't do Kimbalung Village on camera just because I was, it was lazy, I'd already recorded a video, okay, so 547, that's not too bad, but, uh, yeah, I was lazy, I'd already recorded a video, didn't want to record another one, so I just kind of went for it. Didn't take too long. Um, <clears throat> yeah, but also I... Uh, that's all I really did was get uh, th this robe from the last boss. Obviously it's not as good as like... Uh, um, it, it's obviously not Zeus gear. Um, but it's it's still way better than most level 30 gear because of that 10% damage and the 3% power pip also the 5% accuracy So okay, here are my new stats. I have a 43% damage, which is actually really good. I have uh, you know decent resist 13% accuracy which makes my spells only have like a 17% chance of fizzling which is oh so much better <clears throat> Um, 37% power pep, which is pretty good. But, uh, yeah, that's basically it. I like this music, too. Hmm. Hold on, there's no music in here, and it's very, uh, <coughs> very strange. I don't like the lack of music. Yeah, um, I, I uh, didn't watch my old video, but I looked at my old video, and I plan to divide it up the exact same way as I did. Jesus, okay, Grandmother Raven, calm down. So, um, as I was saying, let me just do this. Um, 
What was I saying? Fuck. I don't remember what I was saying. Um... Okay, yeah, I'm com I completely don't remember what I was saying, so I'm just gonna move on. Um... Oh, yeah, wait, I was saying that how I watched my videos. Okay, yeah, and, um, I divided it right at the end of Pegasus Place, which I think is the proper way to divide it. And then the next episode is the end. Yeah, yeah, it seems the correct way to do it. But, uh, yeah, I think th this gives good... Pixelbook Academy gives good XP, or Wisteria, sorry. So, um... It's what I plan to do. Um, even, uh, even if it didn't really give that much good XP, I would still do it. Um, I definitely should get to level 33. Perhaps I'll get close to level 34, but I don't think it gives that much XP that I can get, <clears throat> like, a whole, what would that have to be, like, 24k XP probably at minimum. Yeah, at minimum, that's what it would have to be, and I don't think it gives that much, to be honest. Because while, like, the quests like this do get, like, 920, the, there's only, um, a few quests in Wisteria. I think it's, like, shorter than Marleybone, honestly. Actually, let me look at it. Yeah, it's 38 quests, which is, uh, 12 shorter than Marleybone. I still wish it would have been really cool if they made it so that you could uh, learn one of these spells like learn a spell from these guys because I would love to learn like you know tempest magic and have it be like you know have it be under the category of storm magic but it's actually like tempest magic something you learned in Pixar Academy <laughs> I think that would be cool anyway I, I always remembered wanting it on my fire, like, specifically, like, Ember Magic seemed really cool. <clears throat> I mean, realistically, they're all the same as, like, um, you know, they're all the same as, uh, Wizard City's Magic. I just think it, it's, it would be cool to learn, you know, something else. <clears throat> Dolly Salvador. Who is it? She's labeled as a professor. Who? What is she the professor of? Painting? <laughs> yeah, but I'm recording this um, at 4.30. Um, I've completely fucked up my sleep schedule. I slept from 8 in the morning till 4. So, uh, yeah. It's annoying, but nothing I won't work out. Uh, currently, um, I am tired, but that's okay. And Jesus, my I look very white in the camera. What the fuck? Looks like any other fountain. Something doesn't add up about this place. You know what doesn't add up? Maybe might just be the fact that uh, they're just trying to show more than they have. You know, we have go and speak with Captain O'Hare outside the gate to Pegasus place. Tell him I sent you and that you're there to help. Yeah. Okay. That picture is very strange. I just kind of realized that. Okay, just, just look at it. It's like... Belladonna with like a whip. I mean, I guess it's supposed to be a wand, but it looks like a whip. Oh, this is gonna take three battles, Jesus. Almost use that. Jesus, how white do I look? What the fuck? I look like I haven't gone outside in the last, like, year and a half. I think it's just the color scheme of Wisteria, because, like, the color scheme of, like, Marleybone is very dark, and so, I mean, Krakatopia is pretty light, but once you're inside, it's kind of dark. Um, 
Wizard City is kind of bright as well, but like not this bright. This is very bright and pastel-y. So what I'm thinking is, is that's reflecting off my face and making me look incredibly white, which is kind of funny actually. But uh, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna beat the other four. I'll see you when I've done that. <clears throat> All right, I'm back. That uh, that actually took very minimal amounts of time because I can't beat them incredibly fast. I didn't even have to use a blade. I used a blade the first time because I thought I might have to, but it turns out that I don't. So um, yeah, that's pretty poggers. Um, we're gonna be doing the rest of Pegasus Place, obviously. Um, I do quite enjoy this. Honestly, this entire world's vibe, but um, <clears throat> particularly like this, uh, the street, and I mean, I guess Tangled Way isn't that bad. That's what it's called, right? Tangled Way. Yeah, because it's very, um, it holds like a mysterious, there is something wrong here kind of vibe to it, and I really like that vibe. I think uh, it works really well in this world. Man, these strange plants are not <clears throat> around, apparently. Okay, here's one. And here's the Tower of the Elephant. <clears throat> was, it, was this added from the start of the world? I don't actually know. <clears throat> Like, I don't know if it was a thing that was added in later, a thing that was there to begin with. But, um... Definitely, like, um... It's a cool place, but it's, like, one of those places that isn't as worth it as you'd think. Like, in, I mentioned in my level 60 gear guide video, which I think is the one that has more views, right? Is that the Tower of Elephant has the Ring and Athame that are level 60 gear, like, level 60 gear. Which are the best Ring and Athame for level 60. But the problem with that is that I feel like it's just not physically worth it because the Tower of Elephant is really hard for level 60 and farming for it just isn't worth it in the end. At least I feel like that's true. Especially because the level 56 Rigana thing that you can get from the Bazaar ends up being just about as good. Um, a little bit worse, obviously, but almost just as good. So, I don't know. <clears throat> Hello, Lappin. I always, uh, I, I just really like this, uh, this area, you know, it's really cool. Like, they have Pegasus is just flying around. Pegasi, I guess. If you will. <clears throat> Got a hole in the wall. Shows you where all five are on the map, actually. That's kind of funny. Alright, perfect. <clears throat> you know, I think this is actually a time in my video that I want to do something that I haven't done in a while. I want to plug the fact that I have a Discord. <clears throat> Excuse me, Jesus. Is the f uh, I, I made a Discord for my channel once, and God, I look white in the camera. What the fuck? Um, I made a Discord for the channel once. Obviously, it's not that good. Like, I don't really know how to design Discords, but <clears throat> I put a, a slight amount of effort into this one, you know, and I made it so that it exists and you can go there. Um, it. I have a thing that was supposed to announce whenever I get, whenever I upload it to my channel, but um, it just doesn't really work, which kind of sucks, but whatever. But yeah, if you want to join it, it should be in the description. It's in the description of every video, I think. Um, unless I like accidentally stopped linking it somehow at one point, but it should be in the description of every video. And uh, yeah, so if you want to join and you know talk about my videos, give me recommendations, hang out with people go ahead um, there's only like I think like five or six people in there honestly so it should be fine right I have the blade 
I think it should be. I find it funny looking at the uh, amount of time it took my balance to do things. For example, this first half took 35 minutes. I have a feeling it's going to take like 25 minutes on my storm. All right, um, I'm going to defeat them again because apparently I didn't collect. Uh, I'll see you when I've gotten that. All right, I'm back. Uh, that took way too many battles. I think I, it actually took like four battles to collect that, which was annoying. <coughs> and Jesus Christ, I can't stop coughing. <clears throat> But anyways, um, I actually just realized, I looked at the Discord, and I, I realized that I didn't even actually have a create li uh, a link in the description of my videos. So, uh, I just went and did that. So, uh, from now on, I will have a link to my Discord in all my videos, and, um, yeah. I, I, I know a few people in the past have asked me, like, do you have a Discord? And that's why I initially created the Discord, because, you know, there was too many people asking me, do you have a Discord? So, uh, I do now. So, uh, if you want to hang out, join, hang out, you know, talk to me, go ahead. Um, I'm going to leave a mark here. Because at the end of the street. Hmm. I do like this music. It's very good. <clears throat> Also, this place has a ton of reagents. I don't know if you've been seeing it, but like, there's reagents scattered about the grounds, like everywhere. I've seen parchment, stone block, you know. <clears throat> Jesus, fuck, I really wish I would stop uh, coughing and clearing my throat. That would be really nice. Peg a portal. Nope. I actually am thinking I'll probably try to do some side quests uh, <clears throat> from Wisteria in between episodes. Alright, some Mistwood. Just because um, I feel like doing side quests is semi necessary. I just realized I'm probably going to have this, uh, this amount of gold for a very long time because. I don't really need to buy more bizarre gear at this point. The only thing I really need is a ring. That, that's it, because my theme I'm not changing until level 56, and then the rest of this gear I probably won't swap out until level 40, and that will be Barking at Palace. Jesus, it's so off-putting without music. I don't like it. Shopping list. So this is actually a fun fact. I noticed this in my last video as well. My last Wisteria video. Uh, just look at this. Uh, oh, not not from him. Ophelia. <clears throat> she drowned, bro. Can I get an F in chat for Ophelia? A crystal made of the dried tears of a cyclops. That's wrong sexual this week. They're. This is this is stupid. They make it sound like it's incredulous, and they're like, yeah, we have that. It's just not even funny. It's just sad humor. Rainbow from a sky Imperia. You're in luck. The shipping from Imperia just came in. That's, that's, that's what I was talking about. Imperia. I don't know when this was. I think it came out in 2011, didn't it? Which is actually insane, because that means that if they had Imperia, at least a world called Imperia planned out since then, which is, you know... Rather insane. Some adamant metal filings? Sure, I have that laying around. I usually throw it back in the kiln to melt again. And here's where the second one is, I think. Um, I believe she mentioned something about Polaris. No. I'm pretty sure I have one somewhere. You're welcome to it. Um, okay, so they didn't mention Polaris, but um, um, <clears throat> God, sorry. Uh, the lady, is it Molly, uh, Dahlia Doonstrider over here? Oh, it's Nalia Doonstrider. She mentions Mirage, which is pretty cool, so. So, when did that come out? 2015? So they had all this planned out way back when. I keep going the wrong way.
Oh yeah, do we, don't we have to go into like the library archives or something, or is that later on? Yeah, I think that's later on. <clears throat> but um, yeah, I, I do. You know, I think uh, Wizard Wizard 101 needs more worlds like this, more side worlds that are like you know fun and enjoyable because we only have two of them. We only have Grizzleheim and Wisteria, you know. And I think it definitely needs more of them, and specifically at like a higher level, maybe like a level 40 side world, a level 50 side world. I feel like that would be really cool. <clears throat> no. Yeah, but uh, it, there is, it does look like there's quite a few side quests. So I'll probably do some of those in between episodes just to get my XP a little bit more up. Um, I mean, I'm already way ahead of where I'm supposed to be. I'm going to be starting Mushu at level, like, probably level 34, honestly. And Mushu, you usually start at level 28. So I'm already, like, five levels higher than that. Not to mention, once I get to Mushu, there's going to be a ton of side quests as well. <clears throat> Speaking of that, I cannot wait for Mushu. There's a few streets I always just love. And Mushu has a lot of them. I feel like uh, Cave of Solitude, I always just really like that street for some unknown reason. Because it's not even that eventful. Like, um... Kishibi Village. Uh... You know, stuff like that uh, is always really fun. And I get to live through it again, which is amazing, you know? Wonderful. Yeah, you're good. <laughs> I smell like pasta or something, which I'm assuming my family is making. Chester drawers. I, you know, I'm actually excited for when the box events come back out too, because I'm going to be doing those as well. A level 10 one's actually really useful because it levels you up at like level 10 to like level 11. Yes, I did come back. <clears throat> and here we go. Crystal Tower which has a boss which is actually a rather difficult boss if I remember correctly um, I don't remember why he's difficult I just remember him being difficult <clears throat> <clears throat> maybe he was just really difficult for my balance to solo when I remember that <clears throat> yeah I don't remember you know one thing I really enjoy is the fact that OBS now has a pause button because it did not have a pause button if I remember correctly when I originally um, <clears throat> when I when originally my let's play series came out I did not there was no pause button if I remember correctly obviously I could be remembering wrong but I don't think there was and that led to for example first episode the first few episodes I edited with Vegas Pro and I added a time lapse when I did things like this. The next, in stuff in like Mushu, I stopped doing that because rendering videos just takes a shit ton of time, more time than I was willing to spend. So what I did was is I obviously stopped rendering videos and then what I did was is I tried to just do all of it on screen, which is why episodes increased a bit in length as time went on <clears throat> but I did do stuff like for example in Mushu um, there was this one episode where I was having connection issues um, and I think it was one of the first videos I had to edit with Vegas Pro again in Mushu because I was really pissed off because I used to have to do this thing where my internet kept cutting out and it cut out literally 10 times in one episode which was just super annoying also that was really easy which is hilarious um, you find a small <clears throat> Shimmering with power. Yes. This must be the soul stone groundskeeper Burns spoke of. But um Yeah. I just find it funny, you know. Um What was I saying? Fuck. <laughs> I'm so bad at this. I can never remember what I'm talking about. Like literally ever. My brain stops functioning and then I'm like, uh <laughs> 
I didn't used to be like this, did I? I think in the earlier episodes, I used to have no problem talking. When did my brain start just shutting down? <laughs> it must have been semi-recently. Watching those old videos doesn't make me cringe, but it makes me just realize just how much, um... Jeez, my jaw hurts a bit. Just how much I, how much better I've gotten at speaking on camera because of God, those early episodes, I'm like, hey guys, uh, it's uh, Kaiser Noah back. Uh, welcome, welcome to another Wizard 101 video. Um, today I'm gonna be doing Mushu. Literally, that's all it was the entire time. I never spoke with like any form of uh, oomph or anything, you know. I would always just be like, you know, kind of droll all the time, <clears throat> which obviously you know, progressed. I feel like, um, if you look at my videos, it really changed once I took that break in between, uh, in Dragonspire, and then I came back, and then Dragonspire, you know, <clears throat> I did, I started talking more in Dragonspire, but anyways, that's gonna be it for this episode, um, you know, that's a vibe, we did it pretty, uh, pretty fast, 26 minutes, which is faster than the 30, 35 of my, uh, Balance Wizard. So uh, if you enjoyed, please drop a like, hit the sub button. Next episode, we'll be finishing up Wisteria, and then we're doing Mushu, which I'm really excited for. So uh, have a fantastic day. Thank you all for watching.